Hi folks, just wanted to run through a really quick installation for the hitch port spring bar storage kit and the hitch bar storage kit. It's very simple steps, but just wanted to give you a few tips on how to make it go as, as smoothly as possible. So as you can see on this side of the trailer tongue, I've got pilot holes drilled for the spring bar storage kit. I've got self-drilling screws that were provided that are going to go into those holes the holes are drilled 7 eighths of an inch up from the bottom of the frame because I've got inch and a half bars, so that was a suggested placement, and we'll see if we can get everything knocked out here. So everything went really smoothly with the spring bar storage kit. We got a good fit. Everything's great there, nice and solid. We're gonna move over to the other side of the trailer tongue and take care of the hitch bar storage kit now. So here on the other side of the trailer tongue, I've got two pilot holes drilled at 15 16 of an inch up from the bottom on the outside of the frame also. That's because I've got a two inch hitch and this is a suggested placement for that. So we'll get the self-drilling screws in there and be done with this little project. Well, nothing ever goes exactly to plan, so my drill just ran out of battery, so I'm just gonna finish putting this, uh, this screw in with a wrench, and we'll be done. And there you have it. We've got both storage kits installed on the tongue of the trailer. Everything's up off the ground, gonna stay nice and clean. Now I just need to get a cover to take care of uh, my hitch bar and keep it from getting corroded anymore. But very simple installation, uh, simple design, really like uh, the product and it's gonna make my life easier and save my back.